Donkey Kong. Oh, but if Fox I was going Game and Watch. All right. So the thing about Donkey Kong's Uppy is that it doesn't just have the stupid win box. It also auto cancels a lot. Yeah. Is there anything you could even do about that? What was that? Does that kill? Oh my what? gosh. <laughs> what the? Okay, that's good. That's really good. That's. Yeah. There's the auto cancel right there. Okay. So apparently Game and Watch has an Uppy that can combo into stuff. That's good. That's, that's good. really good. Uh, what the? That's really cool. That's actually awesome. That's really good. I didn't know that existed. Could he do that until like an up air and kill you? If that if, if that's thing that's dumb. Customs are jank. Yeah, but what else is new? Yeah. Um, Vex. <laughs> I'd like to see Vex <laughs> use some more up B. No. That's dumb. No, it's dumb. Yo, it's Battle of the Wind boxes. Actually, though. Okay. There's see if he killed down. that early. Oh. And the down air. Okay. That works. All right, so boss taking the first stock with this tournament or Jeg F game. He go. He went for a nine. Do you think he has a custom or you can only get one and nine? Yeah, but that isn't legal. He's using the uh, chain judge where it's uh, multi hit depending on how many numbers you get. Okay. So like one will hit one time, two will hit two times. It's, All right. Uh, nine still is really powerful. Yeah. All right, that's better. That's so good. pressure. So down throw combos into up B, which combos into everything. That's dumb. Hi, Pasta. Hey, Pasta. Huh? I have to play? <laughs> we have to play? Okay. Anyone want to hop on commentary? <laughs> uh, guess I'm going solo for now. So. so uh, Vex is at... Wait, this boss is at... The uh, percent deficit, but we can bring it back. I was going gaming watch. I did not know that upbeat was a combo. There it is. There's the. It's gonna go for the nair, the classic game and watch. And not gonna go for ding dong. And I'm upset about the naming of ding dong because they had an opportunity to name a combo the banana slammer, and they lost it. Almost get to confirm off that upbeat. Not quite though. Fishing a bit for that up air though. Just kind of waiting it out. I don't want to at first. I want to say that uh, Donkey Kong Zuppie will probably kill now. Especially considering how much rage he has. And that is game one going to Vex. Where's that boss? Jack, who's playing Game & Watch? Right, taking it to town and city? That's a very good uh, picture on I'd say with customs. Because small blast zones means Ding Dong's gonna kill earlier, and Uppy will auto-cancel through the platforms. This is a good but he needs to be wary of the uh, affairs from Game & Watch, all the things Game & Watch is doing. Starting off very strong. Ding Dong doesn't kill quite yet. One more should do it. Game & Watch is paper. He's literally paper. paper. Jumping headbutt is not going to work out. This is that judge. There it is. That was a nice confirm with the uh, short order shot. Uppy is gonna recover. Almost gets him. Nice win box. Out of shield. Not quite gonna kill yet, but it should be that this is the uh, wind punch. Shield's getting kind of low. I'm gonna keep it. Back air is finally gonna take the first stock of the match. Auto cancel windows. Auto can I'm gonna take it battlefield with probably Dan. Trying to edge guard him, but not gonna work. Donkey Kong is heavy, so that's gonna not be sad. 
Donkey Kong has max rage, which is a, a thing that definitely needs to be thought of. There's the win box. Not quite going to kill him. That's going to take it. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we have an even set. Alright, so Vex is Donkey Kong. The boss is Game of Rage. I'm going to ask the team. Yeah, just get me a commentator. Card that I have to reset. Vex pulling out the Ganondorf. That's what I like to see. Customs Ganondorf is definitely a lot better of a character than non customs Ganon uh, Ganondorf. He has that custom down beat. He has the dark fist. Oh, taunting already. These combos, man. 51, 61 already. Vex probably shouldn't have taunted. Taunt to get bodied is a very true combo. So he's not using that custom side beat that will kill her. Uh, but he definitely. Okay, there's the down beat. Uh, boss is kind of spacing him out with back air. Vex is trying to find an opening. It's not working out too well, though. He's even it up, though. There's the down beat. Vex struggling to find his way in, but finally finds him. This is that ledge can't on the down beat, but hits him. There we go. Weird angle. Oh, re misreads the roll. That's it. There's a dark fist that's gonna connect him. And it will kill! That was a very nice read by Vex. Down smash gonna kill Vex, right? Turn now. Even game. Is that even game? Not quite even. Ganondorf hits hard, so just like that, he's taking the lead with two hits. Doesn't go for the roll read, just says, I'm gonna go for what's guaranteed if you don't attack, and down. That's gonna send Gaming Watch at a very bad angle, but he has decent recovery, so he can lead it back. Now we're seeing almost like a reversal of what happened. Vex spacing out Boss, but Boss finds an opening. Ooh. We're going to see a repeat of that first time. These two are just trading the leap. Ooh, that down air is going to take this game. So, game three goes to Vex. This salt. I like this. I'm going to use this more. It's, uh something salty happens, but Vex gonna stick with Ganondorf. Tried and true. Or... Yeah, something like him. I'm not sure. Okay, boss running it back to battlefield. So, I guess this is a best of five. Oh, I know we know this. Anyways, if I had to guess, we're probably gonna see something very similar to last game. Where the two just straightly back and forth, and eventually one of them will take it. Going for a bit of a hard read on that up smash, it's not gonna work out though. Jumping out of the top. Two are just kind of feeling each other out again. What's that? Good graphic job. Next, gonna find his way through the food to get back on the stage, and basically, time. almost. I'm reaching it to flat down, flat up nice, but not quite gonna get it. Don't agree with that at all. There's the combos that we all know. Uh, watch out, Bayonetta. You know? Game and Watch has combos too. So, yeah, this is a bit similar to what we saw last game where. Boss took the lead, kind of ran with it, but then Vex found a way in, and then evened it up. Now, percents are basically even. Don't change me. Okay, yeah. Percents are even. That up there since the, uh, 
down, but he has such a weird hand over here. He's, he's kicking him in the face. I don't care about your invincibility. You on that up smash, I'm just gonna kick it. That F tilt's gonna take the stock. Very powerful. But is Vex gonna lose a stock? No. So now Vex is probably just gonna get as much damage as he can. Try not to lose a stock. Hold on to the stock as long as he can. Wait, box. <laughs> Sakurai loves it. As you can see with this customs event where you see a lot of win boxes. Nice F tilt to answer that hand grab. Long hand grab. Ganondorf at max rage now. Very angry. Not gonna fish for that Ganon side, but it definitely wouldn't have uh, been a bad idea. There's the upbeat. Such a strong upbeat. Ooh, goes for a bit of a hard read. He almost had it, but he was a bit too late. Next seems to stop throwing out these wild up snakes. He isn't Mario. But then again, I mean, he's the one with the uh, lead. So I guess I shouldn't be questioning him. There's a down tilt. Ooh, another taunt. Book end. Oh, hi FDMD, I'm not Dila, but I know him. I've heard about you though. And Vex, moving on to Grands in the custom side event. What a wonderful side event. We got to see Donkey Kong, we got to see Fox. Probably saw a villager on stream. I know we definitely saw...